All right, guys, we got open pilot. This is February, the year 2021, in terms of the latest updates. Um, this is a, uh, I'm driving a 2017 Toyota Prius Prime. Um, I got one of the first comma twos that came out. Um, was it last year or a year and a half ago or so? And, uh, you know, it's working pretty good, especially for a first generation um, Toyota Safety Sense 1.0. It's, uh, it's, it stays pretty good in the middle of the line. Here, you'll take a look up here. There, it's pretty good there. And um, over there as well, you can, I don't know if you can see it, but it stays pretty darn in the middle. door over there again are staying pretty darn good in the lane over there and uh, up there got the up there self-driving we're coming up on a corner here it's raining pretty good I have the uh, windshield wiper on um, uh, what do you call it rain sensing wipers so it automatically does it for me this is the 2017 Toyota Prius Prime Advanced um, it's now called the limited edition so it does have the uh, automatic windshield wipers which I really enjoy having uh, but it does a really good job of uh, uh, driving itself uh, let's see here I think I thought we would come up on a turn I think we'll come up here on a turn a little bit so have i had any problems with this yes um when it first came out i got a uh i got the comma 2 um you know it had lots of kinks it was early on in its software development it was ping pong in and and whatnot that was actually resolved pretty quick um now with all these latest upgrades it it has generally gotten much better um i would say this is probably one of the best upgrades that it's had i've had a couple upgrades where it really wasn't better um, but generally speaking, uh, they have gotten better as time goes on. So again, this is with a Toyota Safety Sense 1.0. I could only imagine how much more better and awesome it is with the uh, Toyota 2.0 Safety Sense version. Um, I think my next car will be for sure. It's going to have at least a 2.0 Safety Sense on it for Toyota. Here comes a turn. It's looking like it's uh it definitely handles the turns okay um, i'm always on the cautious side you always want to be ready to take over the wheel at any time please do not please do not trust your life 100 percent with these um, self-driving software devices it's not worth your life it seriously isn't so if i'm driving by a semi truck yeah my wheel my hands are going to be on the wheel um, if I'm coming up on a turn, yeah, you better keep your hands on the on the steering wheel as well. Um, it's it, it's predictable that it, it can also be it's predictable um, and how it drives, but also it's predictable in terms of its limitations. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put my hands on the steering wheel now because there's a semi truck on my left coming. I'm going to just kind of keep keep to the right a little bit more, and then I got to exit off here anyways but that's how it works um, again it's activated I'm gonna take this exit give it one of these guys and I'll give you guys some more videos later this is uh, definitely my I think fourth third or fourth video with it so I'll talk to you guys later over and out oh here's the sharp turn sort of bye